If you like to play mahjong and you have a set at home, you can practice decision making by playing a game of solitaire. Four hands at one time. I think it's a really great way to build your confidence. If you don't have a set at home yet, I'll leave a link below the video so that you can get one. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. Click the bell when you do, so you don't miss anything. All my tiles are out. They've been mixed and placed on the left of these tiers. And that way we can keep an eye on the number of tiles left in the draw wall. A lot of that has some uh, timing involved for strategy. For the dealer, player one will get 14 tiles. For two, three, four, south, west, north, we'll get 13. We're gonna say that it's the east round and we need at least three fawn in order to win. Three fawn minimum. Three fawn minimum, no chicken hands. Chicken hands are zero point hands. And that does happen by the way. That's why I like to set a fawn minimum. Three fawn. So let's see what we can do for east. Dragons is a good way to start. So is a seat flower. East is one and they just got their own flower. Here's a replacement. They have their seat wind and they do have a south and a west too. Ooh. Oh, they have a pair of east. Look at all these honors. Wow. That is wow. And then we have three bams with a pair and three cracks. So if they have their own flower and they can pung this east, that's two fawn. We need another fawn somewhere. Let's see what happens. So we can look now at south. They have, oh, they have their own flower too. Oh, they got another one. Oh, but they got to wait. They got to wait because we need to, we need to draw f for these too. Let's just take a peek. No flowers. No flowers, so we'll get a replacement now. There we go. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what we can do for south. They have mostly dots, but they do have a pair of one cracks. If they pair up, we could get them to play uh, all pung. All pung is th all three of a kind. They do have their own seat flower. All pun is three fawn. Seat flower would be a fawn. That would be four fawn. So they would qualify with that plan. Also a half flush would be three fawn too. So let's see what happens. Okay. So for West, I'm thinking half flush, which is three fawn. Half flush with bams and honors. Let's see about this player now. They have a pair of Souths. That's not their seat, they're North, but that could help them get to a half flush, which would be three fawn. They do have four bams. Oh, they have a pair of nines. You know what, maybe we could get them to play all honors. Look at all these terminals. They have four terminals in honors. Let's see what happens. Okay. We're ready to go. Let's discard for East. One dot. One dot. Nobody can take one dot, so we're going to draw. Two bam, or six bam, I mean. Yeah, that's not going to be helpful. Let's get rid of the one bam for South. And we're going to draw for West. One dot. That's a discard. We can draw for North. Eight bam, that's a half flush tile. 
one dot. And we can draw four east, one dot. <laughs> They're all out. Okay, we're gonna draw for south. Three flower. Four dot, that's a keeper. They could maybe do a chow, pung, chow, chow, pear. So that's one, two, three, four blocks. They're really set to go. They just need to chow. Let's discard the two bam. And we can draw four west. Two dot, discard. We can draw for north. Three bam, that's a keeper. They have a chow now, right there. Let's get rid of the eight dot. And we can draw four east. Now, south has a potential chow they could take with that eight, but you cannot take a chow from the player across from you. Chows can only be taken from discards from the player on your left. So we are going to draw four east. Everyone's had two picks already. Here we go. Two dot, discard. Drawing four south. Eight crack. We'll just keep that and get rid of the bam. Bam, six bam, let's chow. Chow for west. And then we can discard. We're gonna commit them to a half flush. Seven dot. Seven dot, seven dot. Can't take a seven dot here. We're gonna draw for north. Three crack, discard. Drawing four east. Three crack, three crack. Nobody can take it. North, oh man, look at all those honors. Let's discard the five crack. And we can draw four south. Four crack, let's get rid of it. And we can draw four west. Now they need bams, so they would not want to take that four crack. We need to get rid of those four cracks. Or cracks, all those cracks gotta go. Five bam, that was a good tile to pick. Let's get rid of the three crack. Three crack, nobody can take it. We're gonna draw for north. One bam, good tile for them. We'll discard the six crack. And we can draw four east. Seven dot, that's a discard. Seven dot, right here, south. We could chow it. This could then be a potential chow. Potential pung, potential chow, let's chow. Seven dot, chow. And then we can discard the eight crack. Drawing for west. North, keeper, four crack. Drawing four north. Wow, they've gotten a keeper every time. Look at that. Let's get rid of the nine crack. As pretty as it is, pair of nine cracks, but they're in a half flush. So let's draw four east. Two bam, that's keeper. We need, we need bams in here to clear to a half flush. Seven crack. And we can draw four south, north, keeper. That'll help them get to half flush. Let's get rid of the seven crack. And we can draw four west, four bam. That's a good keeper too. We have potential chow, potential chow, potential pair. These are all isolated. You, you can't do anything with single honors. We need to pair up. Let's discard the five crack and draw four north, five dot, that's a discard. We're gonna draw for east, flower, two flower. Oh, that's a keeper, keeper right there. Get rid of that eight crack. So now this player here is cleared to a half flush. Look at all those honors. We can draw four south now four flower
oh my gosh, they have a pung. They already have a chow out. They have their own flour. We, we've got to sacrifice this because they need three fawn. If you mix pungs and chows in, in two suits, um, then you drive your score down by three. So that's not good. Even though it came in and it looks pretty, it's not gonna help them. So one crack was discarded, we can draw for west. Six crack, drawing for north, six dot. Drawing for east, eight bam, that's a keeper. Now we have to decide, we have a two, three, here's a five, seven, seven, eight. This is isolated, isolated, isolated. These are all isolated. So let's go ahead and discard the north. Nobody can take a north. These are all single honors there. So let's draw four south. Nine crack. Drawing four west. Five dot. Drawing for east. Three dot. Drawing four east. White dragon, there's a pair. Okay, so that's, that's gonna be really helpful there. We need to pung that. Let's get rid of the west. Nobody can take a west, so we're gonna draw for south. Four crack. Drawing for west, white dragon. See if we can use that maybe. Let's clear them to a half flush. Eight crack. And draw for north. One bam, that's a keeper. There's a pair, one, two, three. Potential chow, potential chow. We've got tiles we need to pair up or get rid of. Let's clear them to a half flesh and get rid of this nine crack. Okay, now we're gonna draw for north. West, oh, we got rid of the west. Wrong tile. Okay, here we go, the race is on. South, flower, three flower. We're gonna take a replacement tile. Red dragon. Let's get rid of this one crack. That's not gonna help them at all. Okay, they have a whole bunch of flowers. If you get all four flowers, either the red set or the blue set, you get, you get too fond for that. Okay, let's draw four west. Four bam. There's chow, potential chow, pear. We need to get rid of these tiles here. Let's get rid of the, one, the white dragon for west, and we're gonna pung it, pung for east. And we'll discard the south. And then north is gonna pung. And we're gonna discard the white dragon. It's safe now that there's a pung out and we'll draw for east. Five crack. Drawing for south. Two crack. Drawing for west. Four bam. They could maybe pung that. South is a good discard since there's a pung out. We're gonna draw for north. North got a north. North got a north. No norths are out. Right, let's get rid of the red. It's a dangerous tile. Okay, nobody can take a red. We're gonna draw for, that red is a red dragon, by the way. So we're gonna draw for east, three dot. And we'll look here at south, they can chow. Let's chow. So now they have two chows. We'll discard the one crack and they are cleared to a half flush. drawing for west. Eight dot. Nobody can take an eight dot. We're going to draw for north. Five bam. That was a really nice tile. Let's discard the north. So they have a pung, a chow, two potential chows, or we can rearrange it a little. Pair, chow, chow. They're ready to win on a seven bam. Let's draw for east. Nine dot. Drawing for south, one crack. Drawing for west, two dot. Drawing for north, 
Seven crack, wrong suit. Drawing four, east. They got an east, they got a pung of their own seat. Here's two, three, four, or two, two, three, five, seven. These all need to get chowed. There's a pung. Let's get rid of the red dragon. And we can draw four south. Two crack. Drawing for north, I mean west. This is west. Six crack. Drawing for north. Four dot. Drawing for east, nine dot, south, six crack. Oh, I didn't put enough discards here. I like going six across for discards. It's kind of a standard. There, now that's fixed. We're going to draw for west, nine dot. Drawing for north. Six dot. Okay, we have one full wall left. Actually, it's not a full wall. Okay, here we go. East, two crack. Drawing four south. Green dragon. Let's get rid of the red. There are two out. We can draw now for west. Five crack. Drawing for north. Six bam. All right, let's see. We have pear, chow, chow. Either way, we need a seven bam. And there's one out in an exposure. Now, if we use that as a pair, pung, chow, okay, yeah, that's not helpful. Six bam. Just kind of rearrange when you're in chow in chows in one suit. Just kind of rearrange it from left to right, then right to left until it works. And if it doesn't work, then it it's um, it's a redundant tile. So let's draw for east. Nine bam. Okay, that is a keeper. So we have a pung, a single, seven, eight, nine, two, three, five, seven. Let's get rid of the green dragon. Nobody can take a green dragon. We're going to draw for south. Get rid of the, you know what? Let's get rid of this green dragon. It's getting a bit risky holding on to those. And we can draw for west. Eight bam. That's a good tile. Let's get rid of north. I think norths are out. There's at least, let's see, yeah, there's one out, two out. Now there's three. Okay, we're going to draw for north. Three crack. Drawing for east, six dot. Drawing for south, eight crack. Drawing for west, three dot. Drawing for north, seven bam, mahjong. Self-pick, pear, chow. Chow, chow, pung. So they have a, f a half flush and no flowers. So that's four fawn. Let me know what you think about that solitaire game. Three fawn minimum, a lot of times that means a half flush or all pung. Everyone had a pretty good hand, I think, but north beat everybody to the punch. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the bell if you do, that way you won't miss any opportunities to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an insight to the game that might give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.